food waste is a huge problem across the board. So not only in universities, but the common households and just all globally. It's one of the largest contributors to greenhouse gas emissions and climate change. So food waste, if it were a country, would be the third largest emitter of greenhouse gases in the world. The Student Green Energy Fund has always been focused on different forms of reducing. It's been a lot of reducing plastic on our campus and reducing waste in that way. But thinking about how the fact that we don't have compost available in our campus, we decided to look into different ways of reducing our food waste without having to go through compost. So that's when we found the Orca. So basically the Orca, it's a biodigester. And what that means is that there are microorganisms inside the machine. So you put your food waste in and a mixture of microorganisms and water um, assist in the digesting. So they call it a mechanical stomach because the microorganisms will break down the food waste and then it exits the machine as a liquid effluent, which is just nutrient rich water. Um, it exits the machine and goes through our existing infrastructure to the wastewater treatment plant. So the orca is unique in that the microorganisms that live inside can survive in cold water, which saves us on our electric bill and water heating bills. So we basically are not only implementing a very unique technology, because this is the only biodigester that includes microbes that survive in these cold conditions commercially. and. It's just a unique thing to reduce our food waste on campus. As an environmental leader on our campus, I am very excited to bring a project from the main idea where we saw the machine and decided to go through with it up until coming into the wreath and being able to see our project, our idea, our hard work and dedication for 10 months right there. It's definitely been a long time coming. Um, we've been working on this project since, like I said, October of 2018. So almost a year now. Getting this machine here now is a huge relief. It's seeing something go from, you know, okay, we saw this machine at a conference once and then we did some research online and now it's here in our university. So seeing something go from idea into coming to fruition is just a huge payoff and it's very relieving and it makes you feel like you can actually get things done as a student.